Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scott Delicious McFabulous here and I hope that you are feeling Percy. And today we are going to the Coach Retail Boutique for a special Lunar New Year event as well as checking out the latest Lunar New Year collection editions and the Valentine's Day collection. As well, today's video will feature a special artist by the name of Jordan Chow, and we will be watching him create art live. These gays, they're trying to murder me. But before we hop into today's coach special Lunar New Year event, if you guys love handbags, hauls, coach, luxury, the whole lot of those, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. And if you guys enjoy today's content, make sure you hit that like button as it does help me know you enjoy today's video. And it helps with that pesky YouTube Al. Go. Rhythm. Watch where you're going, you hot water heater. Hi. Hi. Perfect. Shout out to the store manager, Kien. She totally threw me some of those really special uh, Lunar New Year uh, red envelopes. Really cute. She even customized it for me. So shout out to her. She's always so wonderful to me and I really appreciate her. So shout out to Kian and Melissa and Laurel and Jenny and Tyler. Love all of you. But here we got the latest addition to the Hero Crossbody, or sorry, the Hero Shoulder Bag, I should say, in a beautiful apple red color, and I love it. My biggest gripe with releasing this at first was there was no, like, color to it. It was just a black and, like, a jacquard, and, like, the smaller editions had the color, but I'm really happy to see, like, the large shoulder bag have color. It looks stunning absolutely stunning. The leather felt amazing. Genuine gloved hand leather. Mm -mm -mm. Scrumptious leather. And it looks bomb with my outfit. Which, speaking, my outfit is totally inspired by Lady Gaga's album Art Pop. I love Lady Gaga. I even got her sweater on there and just, yeah, I look dope. $670 for the Hero shoulder bag. Next up goes to the one and only Bandit Shoulder Bag. I love the Bandit Shoulder Bag. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. This piece is stunning. In the red, it looks so good. Especially with the friggin... Especially with the brass hardware, like Mama. It looks so sickening. It looks so sleek. And the silhouette is just something to marvel at. The price, not so much. But nonetheless, it's just so sickening. Speaking of the price, it's the average $670, $670 Canadian, just like all the other oh, Bandit shoulder bags. I don't know. I really like the Bandit, but I also really like the Hero. Just pop it, it open real off. quick. Genuine full green leather. Definitely a bag that's going to need breaking in. I had a hard time trying to like one hand open this, but I really enjoy it. And the leather just felt so good. I really, really enjoy this bag. Now, if I had to choose between the Hero shoulder bag or the Bandit shoulder bag, I would sadly have to go with the Hero only because the Hero has no colors. The Hero has no colors. The Bandit has like everything under the sun. So we don't have to worry about the Bandit. <laughs> the Bandit will always have a color, which speaking, it just looks so bomb with my outfit. Next up goes to the Luna shoulder bag. The good old Luna shoulder bag in the red apple color, of course. Now, I right off the bat, I did notice the leather wasn't as like soft as the previous release for this bag was, but that could just come down to like the type of color used for the pebbled leather. 
Like, as you could tell with the hero and the bandit, it was smooth leather. This one's pebbled leather. So I do feel like there was a massive difference in texture and feel. Beautiful bag, though. Beautiful. Definitely not, like, a cheap bag, if you get what I mean. $360. So it's definitely on the affordable side, but it's still, like, a great quality bag. Also looks cute with my outfit. I mean, anything red with my outfit right now is gonna look great. I mean, not beating Umbretta here. Umbretta is just looking uh, sickening. And Lady Gaga's tentacle coming out of her mouth is just, like, a vibe. My whole outfit is a vibe. I can't get enough of it. I know it's either gonna be, like, hit or miss, but it is just, like, the bee's knees. It is art pop in a nutshell. And that was the whole point. <laughs> and then here we got the Bandit Billfold. I believe it's the Bandit Billfold, but it's the Bandit Wallet nonetheless. And it is so pretty! So pretty. Got the brass hardware. Looking real sickening. I mean, the stitching on the back there is not the greatest, but I'm sure not every piece is like that. Just pop it open real quick. A bit of a nice tight pull, so that's good to see for a wallet. It's also genuine full grain leather. So it's going to be a beautiful, long-lasting wallet, no matter what you do. So that's great to see. I really, really love this. What I don't love, though, is the price. The price on these wallets are just so insane. If I could even find the price, that is. They like to hide it sometimes. Come on, Scott, you got it. It's on the back. Don't worry. With a nice zipper pull too, so that's good to see. Quickly grab the price and I okay, I do believe it says 270. Uh it might be 210, but I'm 99% sure it's $270. So that's really really expensive for a wallet. A wallet. Not even a long wallet. Like ma'am. I don't think so. <laughs> I do not think so. But it's beautiful. And here we got the little shearling teddy bears. I just wanted to quickly showcase these. Uh, just in case anybody was wondering about them. Because they've been sitting there. They're really beautiful. They're, they're expensive. I do believe they go for like $200 a piece. And then like the teddy bear itself is like premium price. So be wary of that. But they are, in, they are just really great quality. I do believe they're authentic shearling as well. So now we move on to the Valentine's Day collection. The Valentine's Day collection. Almost kind of like last year's Valentine's Day collection, but this one, the hearts seem to be a little darker. They seem to be a little bit more of like a blood red compared to like a, like a brighter red or like a more mute of a red. $150 for the Snap Wallet. Not bad, pretty cute. Very beautiful leather used, and as you can see, the stitching looks great. A beautiful snap to the button as well. And then moving on to, like, the long card case with a zipper. I do believe this one was also $150, so, like, you either get this one or the snap wallet. I would totally take the snap wallet in a heartbeat, but that's just me. I like my wallet. Small other goods for me are just a lot of fun to play, like to play with and such, so. Quickly unzip it. And as you can see, the Coach uh, New York uh, embossing is on the inside as well. Slip out the price. As, as I said, $150. Not horrible, I guess. Could be cheaper in my opinion, but uh, what do you do? It's 2023 and everything's expensive. <laughs> Here we got a beautiful little clutch bag or a crossbody. And you'll notice that most of the Valentine's Day bags have a stunning little heart charm with a C on it. I would buy I this just for the charm. Take the charm off and literally give the bag to a friend or like a family member or something. Because girl, like I just want the charm. I just want the charm. $270.
just for a charm. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> but, like, it, it's a beautiful piece nonetheless. Like, I, it's totally not up my alley. But it is, it was made with beautiful leather. The canvas felt nice and got a story patch on the inside. It's not bad. Also has a nice little magnetic clip. And above it is like the silk scarf. The silk scarf is so soft. Like comparatively to like outlet scarves and um, retail scarves, it's a night and day difference. Like I love retail silk scarves. I just, they're really expensive at like $120 a piece. Like that to me is just like too much money. You could get like three on sale at Coach Outlet for that price. So you can see my hesitation. <laughs> But here we got the field tote, the beautiful field tote 22, I believe it's called. Quickly unzip it or slowly just to reveal the price tag, which is $610. Very expensive, very expensive in my opinion for like that type of tote bag, but it's really cute. Got like a nice brick of like coach leather wear on there. It's definitely a little different than last year's, but it, the canvas is like almost the same. A little bit darker in the hearts, but that's about it. I do like it better than last year's, I will say that. Last year's I did not like at all. I don't like uh, like pastels and like pale pinks and like reds and stuff like that. I like dark, rich colors, and I like how this one's like a nice dark, rich red. And here we got the Cassie crossbody. The Cassie Crossbody a 19 for $360 in sport red pebbled leather. Very beautiful. I love the additional, like, either chain, or, uh, handle chain, or decorative chain. I love that. It's beautiful. Not something I would personally buy for myself, but it's in a great price point. Especially for being, like, the Cassie crossbody and, like, getting, like, this additional chain you can detach and add to, like, whatever bag you want. I love it. Again, I'd probably buy it just for the chain. I'm so bad for that. I wish Coach would set, like, like sell, like, sets of, like, detachable pieces and such, but not for, like, hundreds of dollars. Because, like, as we know, they'll sell, like, a chain for, like, $150 Canadian and I'm just, like... Not happening. But if you sold like a set or like a mini set or something for $150, like I would buy that in a heartbeat. But I'm not buying a single chain for like that small of a size for $150. And no man. And to close off the shop with me, we got the cute little heart wristlet. Or wallet, whatever you want. It also comes with the Valentine's Day collection little heart charm. So honestly, I'd probably just buy this instead. <laughs> Or the wrestler underneath it. That would be a bit cheaper than buying, like, a whole bag. And gifting the whole bag. Yeah. Like, a lot cheaper. Half the price. Like, hello. <laughs> it's very, it's actually a really cute wrestler, though. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, let me sit and just brush. I'll let you know when, eh? Just give me one yeah. sec, because I'm going to prepare a little different here. I'll let you know when. Just bear with me. Because this is a brush I, have, I hadn't used it today, so oh. it just has to... Um, prime it. That's right. I have to um, <laughs> make sure it's soft enough. Now again, back then, this piece, it's actually a solid ink. Okay. That is beautiful. It's a, sol it's a solidified ink, and what we do um, again, thousands of years ago, you would put on a water on any rock. So this is the, it, it's not really a rock. It's a mixture of rock and this together. Okay. You would pour in, um, water on here. So if you have a, call it a lubricant. Yeah. Water is a lubricant, right? Yeah. You would grind it to create that ink. Okay. So this is actually a dry ink. You grind it, so now you have a liquefied ink. Okay. Interesting, right? Kind of like watercolor. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's a very good illustration. Yes. Watercolor. <laughs> so today, because of you know the speed, the efficiency, yeah. 
everything is liquefied. Yeah. yeah. That? <laughs> so yeah. I just pour it, right? That's Instead right, of, yeah. you know, grinding. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> I don't have an apprentice, right? Like, uh, I'm not gonna hire an apprentice. But you, they would have uh, someone else to help them grind. Because okay. it does dry up pretty fast. That's really cool. Yeah. Um, I don't want this to disturb me, really, so I'll put this here. And again, I'll let you know when, okay? Oh, uh, thank you. Because some... Some sense is... Can I do like this for you? No, I have to do like this. I do have a bigger one, but then I don't think I want to try that. Alright, here we go. Yeah. So this is a little different in terms of the format. And 99, don't believe in you. But all you need is just for one person to believe. There can be a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, hundred people, hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, 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 all righty you guys i hope you guys enjoyed today's super special jordan chow painting and coach lunar new year plus valentine's day collection pieces girl the bags were gagging and jordan chow is amazing i uh, he has no social media or anything like that so can't like tag him or anything but i feel just so honored to have this like this beautiful hand painted piece by him i was the only one that day to receive a golden uh like little pamphlet like this so my um my best friend that was with me he got this like everybody got one of these and then he went out of his way and did something special for me literally said that to my face he was like i'm gonna do something really special for you and i was i just it was really nice and i really really appreciate it like ma'am look at that and he even signed the back of it like it's so beautiful sadly i didn't record audio or anything of him explaining in detail of what it meant because i don't i felt like it was kind of disrespectful so i just kind of endured the moment and this basically means uh dreams coming true i believe the way he was explaining it was love happiness thoughts and then actions coming together to make your dreams come true and that for me was just the moment he explained it to me i was just like yes like that's i i love like i just this speaks to me on multiple levels personally and i'm gonna cherish this forever this is just really really cool and again shout out to kn the store manager she totally gave me those cute little envelopes you've seen right at the beginning 
So I'll quickly show you guys that. They are so fucking cute. Oh my god. Thank you so much, Kian. Uh, look at that. That is so adorable, you guys. Look at and like the special box and everything. Even on the inside, it says Happy New Year. Celebrate the year of the rabbit. So, girl. Mama. Mama is serving today. Like, girl. Like, look at all this. She did all of them. So, this is just really cool. I'm really... I don't know. I just feel like I was, like, spoiled. <laughs> I felt spoiled even though, like, I, I didn't, like... You know, I wasn't, like, technically given anything, but, like, I just felt like the whole experience was very, like, I've never experienced anything like that. So, that was really cool for me. Anyways, if you guys did enjoy today's content, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. Hit that like button. Share with your friends and family. Comment to me any type of opinion you may or may not have had on today's outfit of the day. Uh, shop with me experience or the painting with Jordan Chow. As well, you can always support me and the channel directly by sending me a very generous super thanks donation. Speaking of which, the last one was Milady Leander yet again. Girl, you are amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Girl, thank you. I, you own me. And as always, you can head to the description box below for the three lucky links to my Instagram, Facebook, and Discord notification squad. I love you all to the absolute moon and back. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye. I think it was good. I don't, I don't. I'm done. I'm done. Oh, no. Show's <laughs> over. Show's <laughs> over. <laughs>